Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel once again for another video here. I hope you're all doing well today. So guys, this is the very first race of Season 3, the VRS Sprint. 40-minute uh, race with a pit stop. Obviously, this is, uh, this is Monza this week. So we've got a little introduction here, guys. Um, this one happened to be one of my better races. Not regarding where I finished in the pack, but how the race unfolded. It was sort of incident packed from start to finish. Uh, really, really good fun racing in it. So hope you guys have fun watching this one. Uh, if you do, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell as well. So I'm just going to get this one out there straight away. This isn't my first attempt at Monza today. We have actually had two prior to this, which uh, let's just say they didn't end particularly well. The first one, uh, not my fault at all. Couldn't do anything about the first one. Um, there was a massive collision in front of me. We had literally nowhere to go and we had a, a really ruined car. So we had to limp it home. I think we limped home at about 16th. Um, so that was a pretty bad race. And the second one, uh, my car got flipped. I had an absolute meatball. So uh, I think we've lost about 150 I rating on my previous two attempts. But this one salvaged a little bit. So at least we had some positive I rating in this one. Uh, we qualified 14th on the grid here. We're on the right-hand uh, lane as you look down at the, uh, at the straight here. We are the yellow Ferrari there, the AGIP Ferrari. Um, so yeah, we qualified 14th. I think strength for field on this one was 1,900. Um, let's say I have lost quite a lot of eye rating, so I've dropped down into the 1,800. So, uh, so I hope you enjoy the race, guys. Just going to flick over to the live camera now. So take care and enjoy. Right, here we go, okay, guys. Tony, Season opener go. at Monza, VRS Sprint. 40-minute race with a pit stop. Should be going green any second. Right, here we go, up to turn one for the very first time. Fingers crossed. Take the outs. Oh my god, what's that guy doing there? He's like practically stopped. Well, we got through. Are you all plastic or what? I swear, you're all retarded. He's not happy. That's okay, we're still in good shape here. I'm just going to apologise as well here, guys, while it's a little bit quiet here. Um, I'm suffering from hay fever a little bit today, so you might hear me uh, clear my throat or be a little bit sniffly, so I'll do my best at turning my head away from the microphone. Um, but you may pick up on a little bit of that, so I do apologise for that. When the field checks off, you normally check off. Well, that's quite a steady start. I'm quite happy with that one. At least we got through turn one in the first lap without any incident at all, which is a good start. The gap in front is now 1.0. B13. Oh my god. An oh jeez. How did I get 4x there? No, thank you. Oh my goodness. Did I hit the guy in front then? It didn't look like it. I certainly got 4x for it. I thought I broke just in time there. Oh, he 
He's gone. He's dead. I was just about to say, let's stick to this guy, see if we can put a little bit of pressure on him here. Before I could say it, off he goes. Oh, we've got a nice bit of clear track now. Happy New Year. So guys, if you like this content, if you like the point of view triple screen sim racing content, please don't forget to uh, like and subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell so you get notified of any of my future uploads. Yeah, sorry man. Forget your sorry, fuck you man. <laughs> what did he just say there? Oh, oh no, please don't be a slowdown. Oh, I got lucky there. I thought that was a slowdown on the first uh, chicane curb. Oh my god, I missed it. Alright, Tony. Got out of track limits. Keep it between the lines. Believe it or not, my dog was just coming in there, whimpering. Sort of turned my head away for one second and completely missed the apex. Great time for her to come up and give me a little nose. <laughs> she always comes in when I'm uh, when I'm racing. I can't pay her any attention. Thanks, Piper. So we're settling into the race quite nicely here. Um, this guy behind me looks as if he's got a nice bit of pace. I mean, he is in my draft, so I'm pretty sure he's going to be going past soon, as long as he doesn't send it here. Let's just try to keep this uh, clean and tidy. It's a bit hot in there. Too hot, Tony. Too hot. going to be close enough for a run here. I'm going to stay on the outside because I'd rather have the outside line going into turn one. Car right. I'll let him have this. I don't right really want to fight. Clear. Not at this Car point. Right. Not right. after the last couple of races. Come on, keep pushing. You can have that, mate. I think you're quicker than me anyway. Let's see if you can pull me along a little bit.
that's shocking. I can never get these Lesmos right. Mons is quite a funny circuit for me. I, I really like the circuit in real life, but uh, I'm just not very good at it in iRacing for some reason. Mind you, I did only buy, buy it two days ago, so I've not really put in a lot of uh, practice. So maybe I'm being a little bit harsh on myself there. After about lap 15, the tyres seem to go off really, really quickly. Uh, obviously, the track temperature is absolutely roasting, so uh, I'm just going to try to save my tyres a little bit in this race for the end, because they do drop off the cliff very suddenly and sharply. So I'm just going to try to keep it nice and uh, neat and tidy on a couple of the faster corners. Try not to scrub them too much. Still just about inside draft range for this guy in front. I think it's 1.3 in GT3. Um, if I'm wrong on that, then drop a little comment in the section below. But I think it's about 1.3 seconds is the uh, is the draft distance. You might be wondering why I've dropped the Audi in this one as well. Um, I did try the Audi briefly and it just didn't feel quite right. A lot of people were saying the Ferrari is, uh, after the little update the other day, has been improved quite a bit. So I thought I'd try the Ferrari out here and it actually feels a lot nicer than the Audi here. Um, it's got a little bit more top end speed, it's a bit stronger down the straight. And obviously with two very long straights here, uh, you're going to want that top speed. So I thought I'd pick the Ferrari for this one. So I'm a little bit... Um, what's the word? I'm not really well versed in the Ferrari. But we're doing okay so far. It'd be nice if I can get inside the top ten and stay there. I just want to get some uh, some good safety rating here and pick up a few eye racing points if possible. So we're inside at the minute, which is good. The 
So Detlef behind is now 2.4. So we're 12th at the minute, we're car number uh, 19. Okay. So if we finish here, we're gonna be, uh, we're gonna gain 18 high racing points. So we're in the positive high rating here, which is good. Yellow flag, caution. Maybe someone's gone off in the Lesmo. Oh yeah, there we go. It's a little bit non-eventful this, but at least we're keeping nice and clean here. This is just what the doctor ordered after the last two races, so I'm going to take this. It might be a little bit boring for camera, but um, I'm quite happy with it at the minute. And I say it's nice to be in a, uh, a non-incident packed race for a change. So at least I can get my head down here and just uh, run laps. They seem to be battling here in front, so you never know. There might be a couple freebies here. So we're just going to hang at the back a little bit, I think. Obviously, we'll make up some ground to them if we can, but um, with them all fighting, I'm not going to force the issue. Maybe we'll get a freebie. Dead left. It's getting closer. The gap is now 2.4 seconds. Oh, yeah, Mark's wide. Oh, mate. Oh. Could have had the run on him there if I come in the inside. I just didn't know which way he was going to go there. It's a big old boat, that back. It's a lovely, beautiful car, but it is a big, big thing. Okay, Tony. Ten minutes of fuel remaining. Oh, what's that? Well, I totally screwed that up.
as we can. 20 minutes remaining, you've got 20 minutes left. That's half distance. We estimate 8 minutes of fuel remaining. Johnny, your connection is low. I don't know what's wrong, but... Hanging all over the shows, Bob. Okay, Tony, you're gaining on the guy in front. The gap is 0.6. Track limits. This guy's getting a bit ragged. I think we can get at him here. Yeah? Oh, that's slow into there. I wasn't expecting that to be that slow. Do I do no? Do I? Yeah, go, go, Hold go. Your line. <laughs> Clear left. All right, oh my god, I wasn't sure if he was gonna cut across then. Could have definitely made that more convincing, but we're through. Let's see if we can pull away now. Why you were saying that two laps of uh, fuel left, so we're gonna have to come in. Um don't know whether to come in this lap or next lap. Probably come in the lap after. It's pointless coming in this lap. Yeah, I might go around once more. Chris is uh, pulling in behind, he's gone into the pits, that was the Mercedes that we passed. E9, that was at 151, 37, sector 2 is 1.2, off the pace. Up to P7, okay, but of course that's because people are in the pits, so uh, don't be fooled by that one. 
Oh, come on, turn. Oh, guy behind me's just there, uh, lost it. I think Tobias is uh, is okay. I think he's uh, caught it mid spin. It's quite dangerous there coming out of the, uh, the chicane. If you get on the power and your right wheels on the dirt, it will sort of spin you around. So you've just got to be pretty careful there. That's caught me out a couple times before. 15 minutes remaining. 15 minutes to go. Well, the tyres are starting to feel a little bit, uh... Yeah, the tyres are starting to go, I think. The gap ahead is now 1.1 seconds. We'll fuel you to the end of the race. Lap 14, yeah, it's normally about lap 15 they feel like they're, uh, they're really starting to go. The leader is pitting now. Yeah, and we're going to as well. There's a car leaving the pits. Look out for the pit speed oh, limit. God. Pit lane speed limit. Made a bit of a mess of that. 64 kilometers per hour. Okay, Tony, we'll pull you to the end. Good understood. Where's me man? Oh, there he is. I wasn't sure if he was going to be just in front of that car there. Didn't want to run past me, uh, my marker. Come on. Okay, as you are, I think. That's Tobias behind me. It takes it looks clear. Oh, we've got a jump on Tobias there. Tobias, is it? Yeah, we've got a jump on him there. Oh no, we've got a park with our left. Don't, 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 don't. Oh my god, come on. Absolutely shocking. How not to pit stop? Right, I've lost what five positions. Jeez. again. Is that Chris again? Yeah, it's Chris again. Should we go round? 
Oh, come on, Tony. I think Chris is a very respectful driver looking at it, so I think I can be a little bit more aggressive with him. Doesn't look like he's uh, careless. Looks like he's got a good awareness of what's going on around him, so I've got to give Chris some credit for that. It's going right on my ass again now. behind me. He's doing this and oh come on car break 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 oh I think he's been hit from behind get it turn it oh, I think he's just hit me <laughs> oh my god I could stop the car oh. I don't think I hit anybody I think Chris went into uh, into my side there just coming out of that oh he's doing it oh, I should have pulled over on the inside he's doing me on the inside He's coming right back at me. I've got to let him go. Oh my god, I could have been defensive there. Now I've got one coming up behind me as well. Oh my god, there's a car off there. Oh, I'm wide! <laughs> get on carefully, don't take it one out. Oh my god. It doesn't get much worse than that. What an intense, stressful 30 seconds, or a minute. I think that's probably my worst lap, two laps, so far in I racing. Shocking driving. So where are we now? 13th? Okay. Head down again. Let's see if we can at least get to 11th. Nice exit there. Come on, Ferrari.
I still think there's something in this one for me here. I'm feeling like I can get through these guys. I know the Ferrari is definitely better than the Audi around here, so I should be able to get one spot back. Keep digging. This isn't over yet. All right, Tony. Five minutes to go. Five minutes left. Not like that, though. I need to get close. Just worried about these tyres. Come on, go, go, go! Nope, not close enough. Let's get a nice run down on the straight here if we can. Nope. Maybe. Come on. Nah, too far back. Oh, he's lost it! He's lost it! <laughs> he's lost it! Well, that makes it easy for us. That lap was at 152.06. Come on, need someone to tap on the head. Somebody's got to send it, surely. Absolutely gotten though. If I didn't make those mistakes, I think we would have been. Up around about 6th or 7th by now, I think. Oh, there's only going to be a couple of laps left. Two laps left, maybe. Oh yes, yeah, it's happening. Come on, it's happening. Come on, one of you lot. Oh, bargy bargy. Woohoo! Go on, get in. Yes, get in! 11th, get in. One more, come on, let's get 10. <laughs> I think the orange floor is coming under a lot of pressure there from, uh, from Nick. This could get interesting. Needs to happen in the uh, last corner. Five minutes of fuel remaining. Five minutes. Oh, 
boys wide. Last lap, come on. P11, one more to go. Looks like P6 has gone off in River Grand Day. Oh, P6 is off. That might be the one. Mind you, that's quite far ahead. He's probably... Yeah, he's, he's way, way too far. Oh. oh, yes! No. Oh, I thought he was spending it then. Good little battle between those two up front, though. Who's going to come out on top? Oh, he's going for it. He's going for it. Oh! <laughs> oh! I could have gone through there, I think. I think that's it. I think that was my opportunity. I think if he wasn't right in the middle of the circuit there, I think I could have gone round him. Oh well. Oh! <laughs> no, I thought I might have had a run then, but no. Oh well, P11. Oh, what a race. It's an incident in the first chicane. Looks like it's Cox. There we go, it's over. Bring it back round. Thanks, Hugh. Okay. That was stressful at times. Intense. Ah, oh, there's too many mistakes in there, though. If I cut those mistakes out, I could have finished fifth or sixth, I reckon. Oh, well. Right, let's pull over to the side here and let's check out the results on that one. So, third split of six. Uh, we were car number, well, we're car number 19, start position 14, <clears throat> finished the race in 11th, strength field on that one, 1,932. Um, just move across there, so we had 11 incident points, 74 championship points, uh, we gained 34i rating, and we lost 0.21 safety rating. So there we go, guys. I hope you enjoyed watching that one as much as I enjoyed racing in it. Um, the last, what, five, ten laps? Absolutely amazing. Just constantly on it. Just mistake after mistake and overtake and stuff happening. All my fault. But uh, it led to quite an enjoyable time. So I hope you enjoyed watching it. As always, if you did and you got through the video, uh, thank you very much for taking the time out of your day to get this far through it. I really do appreciate you doing that. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Have a wonderful day. Take care and I'll see you on the next one. Cheers, guys.